Hello everyone and welcome back to Call of the Wild. Today I am back here on Tunapatan. Hunting again for the same two species, but today I will go up a little bit and hunt or try to hunt some no leopards. With me today I have the 300 full action. The Mosin. The 22 pistol because it's all I could hold. That is a big sight. The T43 rifle. And I have the 300 like I said earlier. But that is not my I got a fence weapon. This is. Alright, so this server is definitely modded. Three is that. You can see it. Level five. Oh, look, another level five. Alright, well, I thought the first max weight would be the truck. Or the animal that I'm tracking. Instead, it's that rabbit. That's probably what I was tracking. At a max weight gray auto buffalo. I already have a diamond, that's why I only shot it because it was right there. 3.01 so I guess fortunately and unfortunately at the same time that level or that water buffalo was just a level 3 actually I can't shoot that and I guess thankfully it wasn't a level 5 I thought either of those shots, either of those shots were far further forward. Well, I guess since he's right here, is it? I'll try a little more to get a vital organ hit. Yeah, way for, far forward. And I have to aim like right there. Try and get it. Well, I'm definitely not getting a lack of on track. Yeah, 30.19. When I was fairly close to that next shot, and when I said the longbow's my tiger defense weapon, I meant it's my plus nine defense weapon. So for tigers, lions, and yak, Anything that would attack me, that went right through the heart. I'll be using the bow. That is weird. This might be where it gets interesting. Having two aggressive yak. They have to take with a bow. Actually three. That's a mythical.
I think big animals like that would do way more damage than just that. But a 236 for that one. 157 for that one. And this was, I believe, the mythical. And it was. Got full score on that one, actually. 273 of diamond. And I was running right up onto it all the way up until it morning called. And it is the caramel variant. The first time I've seen one of them. Ah, it's just a seven. Yeah, just running at that angle. I know they're pretty easy to get vitals on. And they run quite slowly. So with a pulley per shot, right in the leg, I got a 27.71 if that was 1.3 points higher, I would have been quite upset with myself, but it wasn't, so all good. So like I said, it is my first caramel variant. I have another aggressive yak. This time I'll shoot right through the heart and somehow miss the skull. All right. There is in fact a level nine yak. That actually looked bigger. Of course that had a chance at diamond. I should be able to get this shot on. Could be a good shot if I can find that diamond potential mythical. And since it's the only one that I shot, it is a diamond at 282. My second diamond yak. Hopefully, I can get more. No leopards. Uh, and there's uh, another yak. Somehow spooked instead of aggressive. Two shots should take it down pretty easily. And a uh, 247 for this one. Almost a near perfect shot. Actually, this is something I can take with that. No against hit and it still went down almost immediately. Right, well, this will actually find the most likely be the last kill of the video. At another max weight. There you go. I've got another max weight estimate. Black buck here. That looks vital. Maybe. Yeah, this will be the last kill of the video. And obviously, not a diamond. 45 kilos exactly. That's pretty close to minimum. But I will go put that yak in the lodge. So this is the wild yak from today. It is... Lightly bigger than the other one that I had. I believe I like point three or something like that. Actually, point two. You can see they have different horns. It just goes like straight out. 
and his kind of curl out, you know, wider. Yet again, still no trip back to the small lodge. Though I do need to go there to put a couple of trophies in there. But anyways, that is going to be it for this video. So as always, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you next time. Peace.